I'm actually, I did Luke Cage, but I'm here singing um, the Scythian Thorns for the Underground. Oh, you're singing the Underground? Yeah. Oh my god. Yeah. That's one of the best music and like composers and Thank like, you. oh my god. Okay, sorry. Go it's okay. Um, I, I, I love Underground and I'm so sad about everything that's happening, know, but right? yeah. the music is the main thing though. Right. Like it, I mean, the storyline is amazing, yeah. but when you hear the music, it just hits you. Yeah. So when you're watching the scene and you're hearing the music, like how, how much, how important is music to you when you're watching this as well? Well, um, as a songwriter, yeah. it's everything, you know, um, it's, and it's all, it, it speaks for the, the parts where the music is, is at where the, the scenes are quiet, the music speaks in a way that, you know, some of the dialogue can't, you know, it can't speak in that way. So it's everything. And I'm so sad that, you know, what's going on. But I, I do believe that if not, if it doesn't find its rightful place, yeah. it has been a ca catalyst for like a huge, huge awakening in Hollywood. It's, it's really so, so amazing. Anthony Hemingway, he's amazing. Um, yeah. Music has been amazing. And I know John Legend is an executive producer. I know he plays right. a huge part in that as yeah. well as he's brilliant as well. Um, when you get when you sing the song, like, and you do you, what's what what's on your mind when, especially when the, with the show going going on in the background? Yeah. Um, well, for this particular song, Gossipium Thorns. Gossipium is actually um, the the flower that is cotton. So it's kind of like I, I was I was raised in East Oakland, California, but I was born in Birmingham, Alabama, and so I went home last year to my birthplace, and I was able to go to a cotton field. And then I, I came home, and soon after I was, you know, given this opportunity to write this particular song for the Minty episode, yeah. and it just resonated with me. It's, it's like the ancestors were speaking to me, you know. So it's like um, I just listened and I just spoke for them because they can't anymore, you know. Well, yeah. This, this show has broken so many boundaries. So many. It's it's impacted so many people. Yeah. Um, how important is this show, and also the music? Going back to the ancestors and kind of and the movement of Black Lives Matter and everything. Right. This is an important yeah, show, which yeah. I'm like, oh. Yeah, right, right, right. How important do you feel this music is for our generation? I think it's, it's hugely important. It speaks for our generation, for those who are with the resistance, and for those that are are, are about forward motion in humanity. And that's what this show is about. That's what, you know, you have to understand the past in order to go forward. And that's what I think the, the well, underground just, it does and did. Because the thing is, it will live on, you know, regardless of what happens. But like I said, I think it's going to find its rightful place, even maybe a film. And I'm ready for that. Yeah. <laughs> thank you so much. Thank Good luck. To, uh, break it like tonight. Oh, thank you so much. I love that music. Thank you. From thank there. you. Thank